Okay, we're back guys. We have losers semi-finals. We have Kitty Kong versus Thy Knight. Now, this might be an interesting match. It's Diddy Kong versus Sonic. I've never seen this matchup. Um, uh, who do you think will have the upper advantage? Um, I'm gonna put my bets on Diddy because the banana, he uses the banana pretty well, and considering Sonic kinda does go on the ground a lot because, you know, speed is his game and all that, uh, the banana will it? definitely uh, screw him up just a little what bit. What is this? Bye, Knight and Diddy. What is it? Oh, this is Sonic. Okay. Are you recording? Yep. Yeah. Okay. We have Townsend, Townsend City? Yeah, Townsend City. Yeah. So we have the Diddy, which is Diddy Kong or Kitty Kong. Makes sense. And then versus Thigh Knight with Sonic. So far they're pretty even, both of them. Yep, 30, 30%. Two stock, two stock. Good. So, what do you think the game plan is for Diddy? Uh, probably just to use the banana lot and trip him up and um, stuff like that. Yep, it seems pretty effective. Yeah, uh, I've played against Diddy. It's, the banana peel screws me up so much. It's really annoying. It looks like Diddy's doing pretty well with those back airs. Oh yeah, his air moves are pretty good. Taking advantage of the peanut and getting close in with um, the side beat. And Sonic just gets tripped up by bananas if he's not that careful. Yeah. He could pick them up if he wants to, but... Oh, wow. Man. And Kitty Kong gets Thigh Knight's first stock, leaving with only one. It's looking pretty good for Kitty Kong. Nope. And he's gonna be... He missed it, so he's gonna get the slight punished by the spring. Uh, I think the Sonic player is being hesitant, or maybe just being nervous, because he is using the B up with the spring, but not effectively. Yeah, you could be using it better. But... Who am I to judge? I don't play Sonic. Yep, but neither do I, but I, at least he's not camping or anything like that. He's going out. He's going in there and trying to get in as much damage as possible, and that's going to be a kill. Gets caught by an up smash. I don't know how he read that, but he just did. Might as well be a book. Nope. Except for the mana, it makes not very good use of it. Maybe. I don't know. Can you spin dash and grab the banana? Uh, I don't believe so. He picked it up beforehand and then spun the spin dash. Wow. Maybe that should be the game plan. The spin dash does help combo into a lot of things. Like, um, if you really can do it, you can spin dash right as you hit them. You can do something like that. You can up air and then up B or up air jump. If you up get air. a spin dash off, you have plenty of options to do another move. On. Yeah, you got plenty of combo options. Yeah. Ooh, Kitty Kong try to read Thy Knight to get him in that forward smash. He's ta definitely taking advantage of the back airs because Dizzy's back air is pretty good. Yep. And red combos. Oh, ooh. Uh, I don't know if he's using the custom. Where he's using the custom, that's for sure. Uh, that can kill pretty early if that he gets it right next to him. I faced it, he, that can kill at like 60. Yeah. Uh, he's right. Yeah, the, that's gonna yep. kill. And like we're talking about, the special custom move B up kills his opponent's stock. I mean, the B here he was like a hundred. <laughs> even then, a normal custom up B would not kill. Of course not. It wouldn't even even explode. It may not be the best for recovery, but it is definitely a good offensive option. I do agree with that. Maybe we're gonna see a change. Maybe not. No, no Looks change. Like we're not. Thank you guys for coming. I appreciate it. Yeah, the banana is definitely screwing them up. It's like a one-time use of villagers' custom plant, like a one-time use for that. But you can pick it up and throw it. Are you gonna go to the So we're looking at Delfino. Or maybe we're just on looking Sundays and at Banning. I think he's, I think he's a little bit too much Delphino on Monday, this. like everything. Do maybe Smash 4 on uh, Sundays and Melee Mondays. Kind of like how Smash 1 does it, right? Match begins he's starting off with a banana, banana with the Sonic. So Pixel. we are at Delfino Plaza. We have no changes today, except 
the stage. Did you see that irony at the start? Did he getting tripped up by his own banana? Yep, the irony. That could be one of the best options for the Sonic player. Grabbing the... Ooh, grabbing the banana and trying to use it against him. Good thing there was no pit there. That would have been funny, though. You still can drown, I believe, Ed. Yeah, you can drown, but nobody's gonna stay in the water long enough to where you actually will drown. Well, if I was playing Cat Falcon, I'd be spiking, and then you'd be dead. <laughs> of course. And Diddy Kong can do the same thing. He does have a spiking ability, but it's just a little bit harder to put off. Technically, every any character in the game has a spiking ability, even Little Mac. It's just... A good spiking ability. Yeah. Like, um, I used to not think that, uh... I can um, spike, but apparently you can because I did it earlier and it was great. Well, we're not talking about Ike right now, we're talking about Sonic and Diddy. Yes, sorry. So, we are. God damn it, he's dodging. Stop. He's dodging all of his grabs. All of the these spot dodge, dodge hair dodge, nice. any type of dodge you can think of, we probably did it. Nice dodge by Diddy from that spin Ooh, dash with the good for it. Ooh. Almost get hits it. Wait, is that a regular custom? Uh, that. No, for Diddy's up B. No, I believe he's just using the same one. Okay, because it looked different. That was good movement by the Diddy Kong going back. Oh, Ooh, oh. gets the kill. Nice. That was very good. That was definitely good timing. Uh, looks like the Sonic players want to close up the stock before any more damage gets in. I. Ooh. Still taking good use of that back air, doing the nice that, A little bit more and that should kill. Oh yeah, any smash attack. I went, oh, Ooh. wait, nice use. That yeah. was a little bit risky, but it paid off. It worked. I forgot actually that um, uh, that custom, it can only go up. You can like scare your opponent thinking like, oh, I'm gonna go it's left, oh, I'm gonna go the right, but no, it only back. goes up, so Ooh. he faked him out. And that back throw. Taking out the stock. Well, he was at like 188, so it's not but no surprise. But he is at 50 percent. Let's see if he can make that comeback. Gets hit by the second hit of the forest man. Ah, uh, looks to like the Kitty Kong just tries to do the B up, closing out a stock because he does realize he is in kill percent now. Oh yeah, big time. Uh, Sonic's a medium character for. Correct, but I could be wrong. Uh, depends who's playing it. But either way, me there's no way he's a heavy. So if it's medium or light, that's gonna kill at 60 if he hits it. Oh yeah. No, nope, yep. and that's gonna be good. That's like 130. It's obviously gonna kill. Nice that use. That was very good use of the up B, the custom up B, I believe, and he wins the that's, second game. That's so very that's good. So that's 2-0, right? Yeah, it's 2 -0. So. There we go, guys. Kitty Kong wins 2-0 versus Five Knight in losers semifinals, I believe. Yeah. So that's it, guys. We'll see you at the next round.